Workers are replacing the roof to a Hanford Canyon that dates back to the plutonium production era. The primary job of Redox, or the reduction oxidation plant, was to process uranium fuel rods, starting in the 1950s. Redox remains highly contaminated. The last time its roof was replaced was in the 1980s. It's important to keep the integrity of the structure intact while a future cleanup path for the canyon can be determined. Proper maintenance on aging Hanford structures help protect the workers and the environment. Work is progressing efficiently, very smoothly, very safely. Due to the nature of this hazardous facility, this work required special training, including radiological worker training, which helps keep the workers safe. Uh, there's been an extensive amount of planning that's gone into this project. Uh, it's an investment worthy project because of that. The execution of the work is going along uh, exceptionally well. When the project is complete, workers will have removed 250,000 pounds of river rock and approximately 1,900 square feet of insulation from the canyon's roof. We look at innovative things like the dumping hopper box. Uh, they're able to load the material, RCT survey at one time, it's never touched again. Workers will use this hopper to handle the material remotely, which minimizes worker exposure to potentially hazardous material. Since this is an unconventional roof repair, engineers had to specially design and build a roof that would continue to help contain the contamination in the building and protect the building from the weather. Experts have built a one-of-a-kind structure that's longer than a football field, which is the length of the canyon. The prefabricated roof will be assembled at the site and will be lifted and secured in place. Workers hope to finish this job in the summer.